Hello guys! Today we're going to make this beautiful all-purpose green chili paste. Let's take a look at our ingredients. We need some roasted walnuts if you don't have it. Almond peanuts all works, but you have to have it. And now we need three to four big cloves of garlic. Then we need some Thai chili to add up another different level of spicy. If you don't take spicy very well, you don't have to add it. It's optional. Okay, now the main ingredient, all kinds of green chili peppers. I used three different kinds of chili in this video because I want to neutralize the spiciness. But you can just use one or two, it's flexible. And next, we need some red and green Sichuan peppercorns to add up the zinc flavor into the paste. And also, we're gonna need some salt and a grinder. I forgot to take a video of the sugar and oil while I was cooking it. But here is some sugar and cooking oil that you need. Now we have everything ready, let's get started. Heat up the pan and just add the clean and dry chilies in the pan. This step is for drying out the extra water in the pepper and make crispy skin. Here's a photo to show you before and after. The whole roasting process takes about 10 to 15 minutes. Once it's all done, we need to cut it to small chunks. If you have a bigger grinder, you don't have to cut it. Now let's add up all the ingredients in the grinder. Citron peppercorn, garlic, Thai chili, walnuts, and the green chili. Once it turns to the semi meshing form, let's move them back to the pan. This time we need to add the cooking oil. We need the amount of the cooking oil that can cover the whole paste. It's not only going to taste better, but also help preserve the paste longer. Use the middle heat the whole time and keep gently stirring the paste. Now we're going to add 5 grams sugar. Sugar gives this beautiful umami flavor into the chili paste. Now let's add some salt. We want it to taste slightly salty because it's a paste. Mix everything well and set aside. Once it cools down, bottle it up and put it in the refrigerator. And it can preserve for about 4 to 6 weeks. You can use this paste with all different kinds of food. Okay, let's see how it tastes. This is a new sauce. Mm -hmm. green, green chili sauce, they're spicy. Oh, no. mm. That's very good. Not super spicy. No. Because no. I use paprano. Mm. This is a garlic sauce then? The yeah. other one? Another one's garlic sauce. Sweet garlic sauce. Not spicy. I do love a classic mm. garlic sauce. Thank you for watching. Remember to click the like button and subscribe to my channel. I'll see you next time.